Hello and welcome to Rhythm Game Level 1. If you've never heard of Rhythm Game, it is one of my favorite, favorite activities uh, or games to play with my students. Now in this game, you're going to be guided through 10 different rhythm examples. Each example is going to be replayed uh, at least two times. Um, and what you're going to try and do is to dictate or write down the rhythm. Now you can write down this rhythm on a piece of paper or on a tablet or whatever you have around you, or you can just think of it in your mind to audiate the different rhythms that you hear. But before before we dive into this rhythm game, uh, let's review some basic rhythmic concepts uh, that you need to know in order to correctly play this game. So the first most basic thing you probably have to know is our time signature. Now a time signature are two numbers at the beginning of a piece of music, and our most common time signature happens to be 4-4. Four, four. And in 4-4 four, four time, the top number tells us, or in any time signature, the top number tells us how many beats fit in one measure. Now in this rhythm game, you're going to have a one measure rhythm that's going to be played. Now what is a measure? A measure is basically the space between two bar lines. So this is a measure, pretty straightforward. Now because our time signature is 4-4, four, four, that means that we can fit four beats in this first measure. Now. The, the second piece of this time signature that you need to know in order to correctly play this game is that the bottom number of a time signature tells us what type of note gets one beat. So one way to think of this is to think of our time signature like a fraction, right? So one way of saying this is you could say four fourths or you could say four quarters. Now the only reason why that's helpful to, to think of uh, this time signature like that is we're literally saying that we can fit four quarter notes in this measure, right? Or in other words, a quarter note gets one beat. Now, what does a quarter note look like? This is something you need to know for this game. A quarter note looks like this. And this quarter note is going to get one beat, okay? Now, we're also going to have some other types of rhythms in this level one rhythm game. So we have a quarter note, which gets one beat. Then you also want to look out for half notes, which get two beats, okay? We also want to be mindful of some eighth notes. So we'll have pairs of eighth notes. Now these two eighth notes combined are going to get one beat, all right? So we have two eighth notes that get one beat. We have a quarter note, which receives one beat. And we also have half notes. Again, a half note gets two beats. And we're also going to have a dotted half note. A dotted half note, in this case, would get three beats. Now, these are all the basic rhythms that you can, um, that you'll hear in at least this level one rhythm game. Now, as we go through this rhythm game, you want to pay attention to the rhythms that you hear, and you can either write down the rhythms or just uh, take note of them in your mind. Now, each rhythm example um, is going to be replayed. So you want to make sure that you listen back and check what you think you're hearing. Um, and also, you're going to see on the screen, you're going to see three different possible answers that will pop up that will help you. But what I want to recommend, um, if this happens to be maybe on the easier side for you, is why don't you challenge yourself to actually write down or guess the rhythm before you see those, uh, those possible correct answers pop up, all right? So try your best. Let's dive right in. All right, let's start our tempo. And this basic percussion that you hear in the background, it's just something that's going to help us keep track of the rhythm examples we're about to hear. Remember, we have 10 examples. Here is example one. One, two, here we go, and... We're going to hear it two more times. One, two, here we go, and... Here's our final time now. All right, let's go on to example two. One, two, example two, here we go. One, two, example two, again. And 
final time. Example two, here we go. All right, on to example three. Be careful, there's some tricky rhythms in example three. One, two, example three, here we go. Example three, again. Example three, final time, here we go. All right, example four, here we go. One, two, example four, here we go. One, two, example four, again. Example four, final time, here we go. And on to example five. One, two, example five, here we go. It's tricky, make sure you're counting those four beats in your head. Example five, again, here we go, and. Right, example five, final time, here we go. All right, moving on to example six. One, two, example six, here we go. One, two, example six, again. Example six, final time, here we go. All right, on to example seven. One, two, example seven, here we go. Example seven, again, here we go. Example seven, final time, here we go. All right, on to example eight. Example eight, here we go, and. Example eight, second time, here we go. All right, example eight, final time, here we go. All right. Moving on to example nine, second to last one. Example nine, here we go, and. Be careful with your counting. Here we go, example nine, second time, here we go.
And example nine, final time, here we go. All right, we're on to the final example. Example 10, hopefully you've gotten them all correct so far, it's possible. This is the final example of Rhythm Game Level 1. Here we go. One, two, here we go, and... One, two, second time, here we go. Example 10, final time, here we go. All right, hopefully you were able to follow along for all of those 10 examples. Now, it is possible that you might have missed one here or there. Um, the real challenge that I would recommend to you, though, is if you want to uh, try and replay this video, you can go back to the, to the beginning, but instead of watching the video and looking at the different uh, answer possibilities, maybe you want to not look at the video and just listen to the audio and try your best to actually write down the correct answers. Again, just an extra challenge in case this was easy. Now, if this was more difficult for you, another thing that you can do is actually go back, replay this video, and maybe you actually want to slow down the speed of, of the playback of this video. Um, if you don't know how to do that, there's just a little settings icon um, at the, the, the bottom of this YouTube video. Feel free to click on that and you can actually slow down the speed a little bit. It might make things a little bit easier for you. But in any case, thank you so much for playing Rhythm Game Level 1.